Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Today we're going to be discussing replacing xenon headlight bulbs before they actually burn out because they degrade and lose luminosity with time. So I found that the headlights on my E90 have really started to fade with time and they've lost their brightness and uh, they look fine. Otherwise, you wouldn't really know they're not burnt out, but they just lost their brightness and it's getting hard to see at night. So I picked up a set of bulbs off Amazon for $25, believe it or not, and they have good reviews. So let's take a look at those. So here are the bulbs themselves, RCR. These are made in China, D1S 6000K. They come with a set of gloves so you don't touch the bulb while you're placing it. You get fingerprints on it. That's how it comes packaged. So let's go for a quick spin in my car and see how the headlights look now and we'll do a before and after. Okay, I'm on a dark section of road. Here's my original bulbs. Keep in mind that they're aimed quite far down so they're looking a little bit brighter than they should. I have to actually aim them up. They would have lost some intensity, but um, they probably look a little bit brighter than they are in real life on camera just because of exposure. But all in all, not too impressive as you can see so let's go ahead and get back to the house jack the car up take the wheels off and get access to the headlight assemblies themselves and change out the bulbs okay so this fender liner is going to have to come out given it's an lci headlight conversion and you can't just take out that access panel So those are the four T20s to get access to the bulb itself. So you're going to unplug it, take this, rotate, rotate it to the left, and out of the way, and remove the bulb. Here's the replacement bulb. I'm going to turn the lights on to test it and make sure it's working and we'll compare it to the other bulb. Here's the original bulb. It's got a brownish, pinkish tint to it and it's not very vibrant at all. That's the reflection on the wall. Here's the replacement bulb. It's pure white with a slight blue tinge, but pretty much like Arctic white, very bright. Don't have a very good reflection point here, but it's much more intense. So that's definitely a good sign. You can see that versus that. Here's the other light installed, very much white in color. So let's go do a test drive now with the new bulbs installed. And I'm not gonna re-aim the headlights until I get back for a fair comparison. They're in the exact same position to see if it looks brighter on the ground. All right, I'm in the same spot right now. And I think it's pretty obvious. You can definitely tell on camera that it's much more of a white light and much more usable light. It feels like it's 30 or 40% brighter than it was. So I'm happy with that. I'll just overlay how they looked before. As you can see, quite the difference. So I'm quite happy with these, especially for 20 something dollars. They're reviewed well on Amazon. So I'll put a link in the description if you guys are interested in purchasing a set. 
think that'll conclude this video showing you how to replace your headlight bulbs and also talking about how these bulbs do degrade with time for anyone wondering i'm still breaking in my clutch on my manual conversion so hopefully uh within the next couple days it'll be fully broken in and then we can do some spirited driving and give you a proper review of how much better the car feels to me based on it being a manual if this is the first video you're catching of mine consider subscribing i do upload regularly thanks for watching Wow.